pop 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 it. Oh. -ho. Alright guys, let's hop to it. I don't know if you can hear me. All right, let's get it loaded up here. Wife will get bonus transition. I just about screwed up right there. And then, of course, as soon as I can't play Call of Duty anymore, Saw Peace jumps on. Alright, so we made it out of all that BS last night. All the androids. Now we gotta start making our way back. Pieces of saw. Leave Ripley out of this. She's just looking for closure. I'm looking after Wayland Yutani interests. And I'm looking to get out of this fucking cell. Maybe we can do a deal. Maybe. This is being recorded. You understand? I saw. Red lights on. I want data. The location of the planetoid where you found the derelict. All data you have on the origin of that organism. I can give you that, and a way off the stage. You just have to let me out. I can probably agree to those terms. What the fuck? Taylor? Taylor, get me out of the cell right now! Get me out! I heard it. What's up, Matt? How's it going, dude?
One second, Beep. Not a good time. Shit is gonna start hitting the fan here. Go to the Apollo core. <laughs> you got any new cosplay pictures for us, Matt? Or have you not been able to get to it? I know sometimes you're a busy man. All right, Ripley. Main access to the Apollo core. Used a bunch of uh, a bunch of stuff to get through that last area with all the uh, with all the synthetics. <laughs> King Penguin is my lord and liege. Dude, I do taxes, so I've been way too busy for the last month. Ah. Yes, he does, Direwolf. He does some sick-ass cosplay. Very, very good. While season is prepared for its ascension into colonial space, it's a foothold under construction. Sylvester Pool is stationed with unparalleled potential and perfect position deep in deep space. Sylvester Pool began as a free port built by Lorenz Sistec Development and funded by our friends at GeoFund Investor. The station's opening would, however, co coincide with tumult in the space race. Years of mismanagement and the rerouting of uh, Sol Thetis flight path left Sylvester Pool in real danger of being decommissioned. Thankfully, Siegson were waiting in the wings to re-energize the station, among many others. In 2124, we arrived in Sylvester Pool and made possible the buzzing cosmopolitan hub you see today. I've come over to Apollo to find out what sent the synthetics crazy? This place has gone to hell. Apollo redirected Core's androids' duties, and they've just walked away from the maintenance we requested after we got the news. Coolants everywhere, gas has escaped, and the primary access lift has shut itself down. I flagged a help request, but apparently I'm 45th in line. The systems are suddenly obsessed with hazard containment. I'm going to find a way down, spedding out. Okay. That scrap. You've got to be shitting me. I'll bet. <laughs> huh. I remember this part. Apollo systems inaccessible. 
Ricardo, the lane's blocked off. The schematics they use for the Sevastopol sales tour should be nearby. See if there's a back door. Okay, let's see. There's a power conduit that links to the Apollo core. I can use that. You think you'll fit? Turn off the electrics, take some deep breaths, squeeze. Easy. <laughs> not coming up there to pull you out if you get stuck. <coughs> Four nine three zero. Tyler, my friend, I wish you would jump on the stream. I'll have to power it down first. Mm. This part's a pain in the ass. I remember this part. Take that compound or not. Thing else over here. Okay. Slide through here. Hazardous containment. Oh, hello, lag. Nice to meet you. And we're going to save. I learned this lesson the hard way that I need to save every time I pass one. That way I don't end up having to repeat areas over and over and over again, hopefully. So I've died a total of 15 times playing this game. Actually, 16. Uh huh. Synthetics. They're what make this next part hard because I can't fight, I can only run. Oh, that was loud. It's okay. Okay. <laughs> no, sir. Ventilation 
I had to shut down that turbine so I could get through there. This is gonna be tight. Good luck. Ripley. You're getting deeper into Apollo and your radio signal's getting faint. I'm gonna lose you soon. <coughs> Great. Just keep them grass for me, huh? There's gonna be lots of Joes down there, Rip. Could be dangerous. Samuel sacrificed himself so I could get here. I've gotta try. I thought he was a pretty nice guy for a synthetic. Me too. Okay. Like that scrap. Ricardo, main entrance is locked. Any idea what to do next? I can't hear you, Rick. Your signal to check the break. Quick straight. Oh shit, that's gas. That's gas. I about died right there for you. Okay, let's check this out here. Apollo would ask for your patience during the current hazard containment alert, which is currently at level Omega. Spending something crazy just happened. Sylvester Pool's off the market. We got a buyer. After all those endless presentations and tours, I guess the talks weren't stalled at all. Someone at company headquarters just had to click his fingers. A message of confirmation just came in. Apollo's currently receiving a packet of new operation rule sets, so I guess the deal's sealed. This is board level. Need to know stuff until it's announced to shareholders. Quite the promotion, huh? There's a lot of secretive shit going on on this ship. There's the gas mask, so so now I could go back to those other places that had gas and be able to actually enter them. You can if you want to. Shit. Oh god, he punched me. Dick. Uh, where the fuck is my thing at? I no longer have my fucking tracker? Either that or your right bumper quit working. Probably gonna get killed before I get this code in. I can't get to it, he'll know that I'm there. It's a fucking synthetic. Oh shit, I'm fucked. Fucked. I should have healed. Damn it!
I've heard you button mash. Don't give me that. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, I fuck, I'm all the way back here where I gotta shut off the damn turbine. That's a bitch. And that thing finally shut off? Good lord. I know, I feel bad because Tyler tried to invite me to a party, but I can't, like, stop what I'm doing. Turbine's off. Way should be clear. <laughs> Told you. You button mash. Uh huh. Michael Myers. Those guys are rough. Sentinels don't play. <coughs> There's a save, okay. Probably missed that the last time. Whew. It is hot. Yeah, I know. Fuck. Their grab radius is fucking ridiculous. Yep, alien isolation early, man. Call of Duty would not let me have a lobby, so I had to say fuck it. Uh, that's what I was going for, Matt, but I didn't get a chance. I am going to save right here, though. So in case I do die... Of course. You fucking twat. Running causes accidents. There's three of them after me. I don't want to know about Sevastopol safety protocols. Yeah, locker did not work. I just tried a locker. You saw the end result of that. Resulted in him ripping me out of it.
Wow. So apparently he just knew I was in the locker. Yep. Nothing. He didn't say anything. Last thing he, last thing he had in there was sit tight for a minute. I think I just got had. Keys. Come on, baby. Of course you would want me to follow this schmuck. Okay. If I power these up, one of them should give me access to Apollo security banks. Alright, first thing we're gonna do is save. I'm not sure why I got nabbed in that locker last time. But then again, I've had the alien do that before too, where it just, uh, for whatever reason, knew that I was there. Oh, this... I know a way to reduce Apollo's security capabilities. Yeah. Well, you're fine, babe. Oh, no, 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 we're not going that way. Let's go back this way. Q. 
Come on. Ripley. Don't I always have trouble with this I had trouble with this part last time trying to figure out what the hell I was supposed to do. So there's that vent there. Hmm. Cannot for the life of me remember what I'm supposed to do, though. Where you at, little code? Oh, does he not know how to set it up? He just has to go to host, non-dedicated server. Okay. And then all those... All those little features in there are... Saving that game. Love this part, yeah. Thing's crazy. Uh, mm -hmm. He goes to host non dedicated server and then he has to decide like, go to your host, like you're gonna host one. You go to host local and then all those settings in there he can mess with. What the hell? There's general rules, world stats, all that stuff he can mess with, increase and decrease. Okay, so then he just goes down to the bar that says host non dedicated server. Yep. And just press A and then he can name he can name the session whatever he wants to. Do not mark the privatize box. Sons of bitches. Yep, and then just start it. But he has to choose which map he wants to do too. He can do the island, the center.
Yes, I agree, Splinter Shield. There needs to be a sequel to this game. But it needs to be done right. It needs to be done right. Uh... Central Core. Uh, all the way up. Yep. Class, human interaction, request for inter corporate messaging received, outgoing message to Wayland Utani representatives accepted and monitored. Temporary emergency measures indicated in San Cristobal Medical Facility. No further information provided. Purchase order received. Well, Utani operational rule set packet received. Verified and installed. Emergency measures installed in San Cristobal Medical Facility. Extended. No further information provided. Station scans initiated under Wayland Utani directive. Unverified scans of reactor system. Special order 939. Priority 1. Protect specimen. Maintain station quarantine. Disallow communications. He is alive. What is up, bonding agent? How's it going, man? Um, no, nothing really. It just depends on what he wants to do, and how quickly he if if he goes through all those rules and looks at them, they're pretty self-explanatory. If he has one, if he has a question about one or something, just ask me. I should be. Able. So this is a this is a cool part of the game where you actually figure out that the the Apollo system was set to make sure that the creature actually spread throughout the the system. Spending its ransom with the Whalen Utani buyout, it's more important than ever that the flight recorder handover goes without a hitch. There'll be low level execs and won't know jack about the buyout but if they hear rumors about disappearing people problem well I don't know I don't want to rock the boat and neither do you let's just keep everything nice and quiet we don't want them having second thoughts good had the flu this past week really knocked me on my ass finally getting back to normal that's good to hear bonding glad to hear you're feeling better man better to get it out of the way now right Better to get it out of the way now. So we're heading on up. Okay, this part came up. I remember not really knowing what was going on until those elevator doors opened, and then I was like, oh, fuck. Make sure you check out that springtime sale bonding. Some cool games on there, man. Glad to see you didn't miss this. Oh yeah. Oh yeah.
Later, Matt. Oh, nice. If you've never played it, man, the, f the first two are awesome. Incredibly awesome games. Uh, the third one is okay. It's more artsy than good. My opinion. It was still fun to play through, though. You gotta have fun. Oh, you should have told him to increase the difficulty too. Hopefully he spawned you guys in an easy area. Yeah. The third seemed more for art than anything. All right, one second, guys. I gotta get a drink. I gotta run to the bathroom. I'll be right back. Stick around for a momento.
All right, guys, thanks for sticking around. Really do appreciate that. Yeah, we should have. <laughs> oh yeah. Can't wait for losing. What's that? Yeah, um, you do. It has to do with his connection. Yep, it depends on his, um, depends on his connection as a server. Holy shit! Like, why did you even turn around, you fucking prick? Oh, he's gonna kill me. He's like, I'll fucking kill you for that one. Ouch. There's another death. What's that? area. <laughs> He's punching me in the back. Now he's gonna kill me again. Get ready for another death. Oh my goodness. Uh, you can. It's up to you. And I'm dead. Again. This fucking asshole is just trying my patience. I've had more trouble with synthetics this time around than I have the alien. Which is absolutely ridiculous. Yeah, if you want to
like it isn't authorized to leave this facility. Ronnie Ronnie's excellence. I just want to know. Fuck, I'm muted. Sorry, guys. Thanks, Bonding. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, Ripley. You fucking prick. Turtles don't mess with you. You son of a bitch! Get the fuck off of me. Aw, oh, shit. Thank god he only punched me. Come on, come on, come on, come on, climb. Fuck you, you android prick. God, I don't know why she's gonna take so long with these damn animations. It's like, let's fucking go, lady. Android's only killed us like four fucking times we've been here. Let's do this.
be smart to tame out the gate because then it'll start laying eggs for you if it's a female and you can eat them. It's going to result in me dying again. Power level too low. I'm not. This is an entirely unauthorized alert. Please stop interfering. Restore power. Okay. Device invalid. Okay. be a lap fest. Sometimes I feel like she runs slow as hell to get somewhere. Nope, ain't gonna happen now. She fucking took too long. And then he fucking grabs me. and charge packs. New follow. Jazel, thanks for the follow. And here's my next death, maybe. Nope. Fuck off me. There it is. There's an extra hundred keys for you. Because fucking synthetics. I hate not having my weapons. Drives me nuts.
follow and reporting a good service throughout Sevastopol.
This could require my attention. Follow me, please. I'm going to catch you. Don't run. This could really do some damage. I know, I got it unmuted. Sorry, guys. Oh, that's something he could have increased too as a night cycle. Oh. Fuck you, asshole. Chief, I'm heading down to the reactor maintenance now. As requested, I've locked the shutters behind me. The code you need is 6832. When you need down in the reactor maintenance floor, as I've got reports of localized brownouts all over the station. I know it's going to hell on station, but I can't see anything up here that would be compromising power delivery. Can you run a full systems check down here? Flores, if you're still there, find some, find somewhere safe and wait. I'm coming down to you. We need to stick together now. Sanders is dead and at least four of the other engineers are missing. One of those damn androids nearly took my head off, so I've scavenged some parts together to make a weapon. I've got enough kick to punch a nice clean hole through one of these bastards. I'll be there as soon as I can. File corrupted. Shutter code was 6832. This bolt gun's actually awesome. One of the better guns in the game. There it is. If I can dodge these other...
the fuck was that? <laughs> Ricardo, have you ever been to the reactor? I did some training in one. Seems like a lifetime ago. Come on, more bolt gun ammo, oh yep. You guys need to build a house. Look at the size of that round. Good lord. Is that? <laughs> All right, Ripley. Glad I fucking saved right there. I don't know how many times I've shot myself in the foot on this game the first time through. So I think that's officially death number 20, I believe. 
Not 100% on it, but pretty close. But I probably had three times as many deaths in, in one area of the game in the medical wing the first time I played it, so... He's like, oh, I'm an android. This might require my attention. Let me be a dick. And boom! Stun baton charge, please. Ah. Round two. Here we go. Right through your mouth. It's crazy that it puts just a little pinhole in their face. Yep. Oh my god, are you serious? He fucking survived that? Ass clown. Another sensor. All right, Ripley. Reactor maintenance, here we go. It'd be crazy being down here inside of a, like a giant fucking reactor trying to do everything. Get systems back. It'd also be shitty to find out that the whole ship was set up as a containment for that thing, just so it could breed essentially and do what it does. We did start this a little bit early tonight, guys, so it was nice. Uh, I was actually having fun playing Call of Duty, but it, uh, you know, for whatever reason, would not let me have what I needed, so. Hey, there's my flamethrower back with all of its fuel, so that's good. Oh, good lord, I remember this part. They're trapped in some kind of nest. There are eggs. It's, it's like a farm. Shit. I'm just get out of there. No. Yeah. No. I have to overload the alpha core. Which... There really is no hiding down here once the shit hits the fan. It's just... Pray to...
Grab all this stuff here. It's better to burn the eggs if you can't before they get out. Those face huggers are hard to see on the ground. There's one part of this where I kept dying all the time. <laughs> oh boy. Into the nest. Crazy thing is, like, according to alien lore, like, if you're stepping on their hive space, they they know right where you're at. It's probably dead. fucking nest. The nest is fucking spooky just because it's like shit like that. Like those face huggers, like man, they're they're ruthless. I don't like them. Always feel like I got to stop. Shit. I heard it too. It was too late. Bloop. And I think I forgot to save on the way back by, so that sucks. Death number 21. Even the face huggers are instant death. One second, guys.
All right, guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. Yeah, I thought there were two eggs in this area. Alright, let's go ahead and enable the conduit. I'm gonna overload this core. I'm try to fry these sons of bitches. Let's start overloading the core. Yes, save, save, save. I should be able to make it back to this room and save. We don't have to do that again. <laughs> Thank you, Bonding. Come on, come on, come on, gather yourself, Ripley. Oh, he's gonna, he might get me here. He's awfully pissed off, I know that. Fucking hell. <laughs> At least I got that save in right there, so he won't be here. Man, I'm tired of that fucking tackle bullshit that he's pulling. Which that in itself would make Nightmare a pain in the ass because it takes away that tackle feature. Like it will not do that tackle, instead you die. This game gives... This game gives me anxieties. I believe it, man. I've played through it once on this hard difficulty. And it gives still gives me fucking anxiety. You mind grabbing that, Ripley? Damn. No power. Great.
Come on. Get out of here, you scumbum. Jesus. Let's get this refilled. Man, I used to have a shit ton of those injectors. I really wanted to do it on Nightmare, but for stream purposes I decided not to. It might be something maybe in the future if we ever revisit this game again. Um, let's see if we can't do it. But man alive, it would be a pain in the ass. I say that because like there's a lot of things in the game that it gets rid of, things you can't do. things the alien can do. <laughs> I think if you're looking to restore power, you go to the console in the center of the large room. I'm not sure though. Oh, never mind. You got it. <laughs> yeah, it just took me a minute. Like the couple parts of the game, I don't, I don't fully remember. Oh, fucking face hugger, get out of town. I should have fucking saved right there. Damn it. God damn it. <laughs> I haven't played this game. I haven't seen this game being played in forever. Alright, uh, this is, like I said, this is my second time through it. I enjoy the hell out of this game. I originally bypassed it on the. I originally bypassed it on the 360. Um, I did like one part of it and that was it. Um, I was using it kind of as a filler game. Whew. Don't you dare come in here. I will vaporize your face with this. And then I uh, played back through it on the one. Incredible game. 
always recommend it to people now if they've never played it. Overload the beta core. Those little shits are what got me the last time trying to get out of this core. Oh my god. That injector. this. I don't take too kindly to scary games. I think I've played like 15 minutes of Outlast and deleted the game because I couldn't take it. I've actually streamed Outlast before too. Um, I beat it on hard. I have yet to do it on insane difficulty, which is a one death to go. You get one death. If you die, you're fucked. Uh, but yeah, that game, that game scared the hell out of me a couple times. Save, 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 Ripley. This is where I get nervous, is like saving down here. I do fancy myself horror games, though. I wish it would quit doing that damn tackle maneuver on me. Where are you telling me to go here, game? More reserve. We are almost out. Do you mind standing up, Ripley? Come on, 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 please, 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 please. Thank you. We may die here, but. Holy shit, that was luck. Oh, I hate that fucking tackle bullshit. Like, how would you escape that in Nightmare? Because that would be a death.
That would be, that's a death in nightmare mode. It takes away the tackle that the alien has and counts it as a grapple. And you're dead. No. Almost did. Ricardo, I can destroy the nest. Ripley, you've put yourself in enough danger today. I can power up all the cores, overload them, and then initiate a reaction purge. The tackle is pretty cheap. Yeah, it is. GG! This is what's gonna happen. There are emergency overflow circuits that feed excess power into the Make sure if you guys are new, hit that follow button, guys. We stream seven days a week. We are always here. Three times a day. Spooky games are 10 p.m. to whenever, Central Standard Time. Survival games are 10 a.m. to uh, usually about 1 to 2 p.m. Just depends. And then um, shooters are from 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. Uh, yeah, 10 p.m. So. Wombo gun. Show me some love. Yeah, I agree. The tackle's pretty cheap. Um, like I said, probably made even cheaper because in Nightmare because it's an instant death. I can't say that I have yet to use a flare on this go around. I like that ammo. What the fuck? Shit. I have to take some damage here. Oh, this is gonna be a death. Never mind. Fucking hell! Yep. I, for whatever reason, I have died more by synthetics this time than I have and than I have the alien. It's ridiculous. I can power up all the cores, overload them, and then initiate a reactor purge. It'll destroy everything down there. I'm not trying to persuade you out of this rip. I'd just like it if you didn't die. This is what's gonna happen. There are emergency overflow circuits that feed excess power into the local capacitor banks on each tower. If I decouple them and discharge the system, the purge will be external. The nest is right in harm's way. I have no clue what you just said. Just find something to hold on to. Oh, I see you play Wildlands. Any chance we can play together? Uh, we play with followers who have 5,000 keys to cash in for game time. And uh, we play with uh, subs. Uh, we've already currently beat Wildlands. Um, I'm actually kind of, we actually were kind of disappointed in the ending and everything, so I doubt I will ever revisit that game, to be honest with you. Just got to be honest, man. It was, the ending was just super disappointing after all that work. The info is in the, oh, the info is in the chat.
stupid ass androids, man. I don't remember having this much trouble with these fuckers. Mine, Ripley. I could see that, and I could totally agree. I only play it and was, and with the restricted HUD and on the highest difficulty because it's the closest thing I have to military combat sim. Yeah, we played it on advanced difficulty, and it was it was fun at first. It got repetitive, and then uh, the ending just really just like I called that game. I called the ending for that game about. A little over a third of the way into it, probably. Yeah, we called the ending. The wife and I came to the deduction of what it was going to be. And it was. So. That was a little disappointing. Why not ask me about Sylvester Pool safety protocols? Why don't you just piss off, Android? You're not worth this much trouble. <laughs> One of them burst into flames, that's funny. You always know a working Joe.
Yep. Don't tell me there's a save station in here. There is not. that shit. Still someone the station. Shit. Huh. I'm I'm sorry, Ricardo. Just get back to the Marshall Bureau, Rip. Please. From, from Dead Space. I might have been muted there, Bonnie. Poor Ripley. She and Isaac probably have the same therapist. Yes, they do. I could see him sitting in a room talking to the same therapist. She goes through a ton of shit. She's tough, though. She survives quite a bit of it. Take this chance here. Get everything reloaded. Damn it. It's 
Look at the size of that shell that it shoots out of there. Ooh, a much needed save. Find a short range ambulance. A short range ambulance, are you kidding me? know where I'm at. That's where I picked up the, uh, the other part of that torch right there. That's cool. I forgot about that area. I wish she had a ladder slide. She could just get down real quick. ran down here but see it shows movement so I'm definitely not gonna start running now restore power to this area How have I not restored power to this area? It's like the second area of the damn game. pack To get a little bit more flamethrower fuel. Still have not used any of the sensors. Nice, some more bolt gun ammo. The fuck is that?
Blasting caps. No hospital, no authority, no hope. Well, here's the damn magazine center. Looters will pay. Let's check out this room. Even though I did better on the first time, like through the first part of the game, I'm still struggling with, uh, I'm still struggling with uh, med kits. Like I wasn't until a couple of these areas, and then game's like, bam! Now you are suck on that. What the hell do you got here, buddy? Watching the Weather Channel. Sweet Nostromo log. What's up, Alpha? Wow. Ripley just got throttled right there. Come on, Ripley, you mind pressing the fucking button here? Jesus. <sighs> no, I didn't die. Oh, that damn tackle. Shit, fire. Dental surgery. Yes. Oh, look like you had a bad experience at the dentist office. Hopefully, you got insurance, buddy. Weird. Ah, oh, this fucking place again. This place is pain. I can't remember if I have to worry about humans here. Yes. 
Oh, you mother sucker. Oh, just gotta worry about androids. Oh my god! Oh, you bitch! Yep, dead. Son of a bitch. Of course, I didn't have to worry about humans, I have to worry about more fucking androids. Ugh. Nerd, nerd, I'm an android. feels weird to say it like that. Rip Ripley. It's probably gonna pull me out of here. Last time one of these fuckers pulled me out of a locker. You're making me waste company time. Like he gets a paycheck. How many times you guys died over there? A lot. Are you playing a game with me? Kinda. Ripcord, thanks for the host. Damn android. Bang version three. Are there three versions of every schematic in this game bonding? Do you know? Level three access tuner. Your 
welcome. Thanks for the dinosaur. Hey, no problem, man. You cashed it in. We'll give it to you. No problem, sir. Oh my god. I about failed that. I'm going slow. Uh, getting there. Still got a little ways to go. <laughs> he blacked out. Who's the other body right there? Health up. <laughs> Wish I knew how many times I've saved during this game. Isadora. Bring the Inesadora systems back online. It's that door. He just keeps blacking out. Yeah. All he's got to do is sneak down there. Get the code off of here, probably. Marlo Heist says he just picked up some kind of signal. I've got Lewis trying to decode it now. Could it be the Nostromo? Want to come up and see for yourself? Technicians report 1024 2137. Marlo, I just had to do some much needed work on the sublight engines. The old girl was complaining so loudly, I'm surprised something didn't fall off during the last jump. Everything's holding together for now, but she'll need a full over overhaul soon, and not just for the core systems. We keep pushing her like this, and we're going to end up being like being the only salvage crew hitchhiking through the deep space. It's going to be an expensive job, so let's hope you're right about the, that beacon. It could be our last chance for a decent paycheck. Anyway, I had to reset the door key code afterwards. The new one is 4510. We're outside Sevestapool. Marlo and Foster woke up 
first. She looked terrible. Meeks and me are about to take a shuttle to the station, but, well, this has got to break quarantine procedures, right? It's Marlo's ship. She's Marlo's wife. Things got heated and Meeks got a bloody nose, so I don't know. Maybe the doctors will give her the all clear and things can get to normal. But if they sniff it out when we get on board, I don't want any part of it. Marlo doesn't pay nearly enough for that kind of noise. So Marlo is the one that brought the infected person on board. Sevastopol. And then they changed the protocols to keep... Ripcord, redeeming the push-ups. All right, man, one second. Let me get to a reasonable place here. I don't know if that's possible in this game. Come on, reload the batteries. There we go. Ah, oh, shit. Oh my god, I never had this trust trouble. There we go. Jeez. pumping. Ricardo, in case you're hearing me, I've got the human civilized basic power systems back online. Doors should be open. Hopefully some light. Still no sign of mine. Hey, Ripley. Welcome to the Anisadora. Marlo? Where are you, Marlo? Thanks for switching the power back. Find Marlo. Right, I'll sit right back here in this corner, ripcord, and I'll uh, shell out your push ups here, real quick. One second, guys. He redeemed push ups. I got to do them. That's how the job works, so. Are you ready? No 15 pets of Lilla. Uh-huh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. That was quick. Are you safe where you're at? Ripcord said that was only 14 and a half. Come here. Ripcord said that was only 14 and a half. Okay. Excuse me, Doji. <laughs> you feel stronger? I'm glad my push ups are working vicariously through you. Oh, 
Yeah, plenty of free spots, Marlo. Taylor? Taylor! Marlo, what are you doing? What's that? We stream. We're streaming with the Xbox streams, but it's compressed to a 720. <laughs> Getting stronger through osmosis. Nice. Whatever it was that attached itself to Foster is dead. I found it on the floor by her bed, all curled up like a spider. Foster said she felt fine, but I insisted on putting her into hypersleep. That thing must have done something to her, but maybe I can slow the process. Sefesta Pool's the nearest station, so I'm going to get her checked out. Quarantine will probably... Quarantine will be a problem, but I figure the Nostromo Fly Recorder will be maybe my ticket in. Whatever we have to do. That is not what I wanted to do, game. All I wanted to do was just scroll down to the next one. And Nessadora, the Marshal, this is Marshal Waits of Sevestapool. Officially, I should deny your request to dock. Sevestapool is currently being decommissioned, and I can't compromise security for unscheduled vessels. However, in light of the property you have found, I will allow a small number of your crew to dock via a short range shuttle. I must remind you that Sefesta Pool is entitled to cut to a cut of any reward for return of said property once it's on the station. Let me know your decision. Waits out. There's a bunch of shysters in space. Everyone wants a cut of something. Oh hell yes, collect that injector. Can't make these things fast enough. I need to find a damn med machine that spits them out. Okay. Let's continue on. I'm super excited because one of our subs, uh, subby guy, since our computer took a shit, he actually has a rig that he does not use that is less than a year old that he is going to give to us, which is unfucking real I believe that uh, it'll be a fully operational rig, so if we can get this other one fixed, then we can start doing PC games as well on top of that. Plus, we have something else coming for you guys that we're not going to tell you just yet. I'm not going to tell you what that is.
Okay. Blasting cap. It's a pretty quiet ship so far. Lots of medical supplies. Good eye. Power core. Okay, let's get it geared up here. Added report. Personal message. This is for my daughter. Hi, Amanda. I'm recording this for you, my sweetheart. And I hope you get to hear it one day. You see, I, um, I got into trouble. Um, my ship, there was an accident, sweetheart, and, um, we found an alien creature. It was very dangerous. And the only way we could stop it was to destroy the ship. Uh, I'm okay. I'm stuck on this lifeboat, long way out. But we had to destroy the ship. We had to destroy the Nostromo. We just couldn't risk bringing that thing home with us. I needed to protect you. Don't worry. Don't worry about me. I'm sure I'll see you very soon. I love you, sweetheart. Message end. She's doing a lot better since she took some shrapnel on the hip. That'll turn the reactor into a goddamn new. You'll destroy the ship at the station. It will annihilate every trace of that creature. Ripley, it's the only way. I can't let it live. And I'm not letting the company have it, or they'll just start the whole thing over again. Listen to me! We don't have to do this! Nice pipe wrench to the back of the dome. He set it going. He set it going. Taylor, I'll stop the overload. You have to help me. Go to that console. Warning. Fusion reactor overload in progress. Open the fusion system so I can work on them. What? I need power sent to the auxiliary generator. Look for the letters A U X. That overload, son. Okay, you're doing good, Taylor. Now switch the maintenance terminal from auto to manual. Do you see it? Why is there tape on this?
Come on, Ripley, deactivate it. Shit. Stand there and watch it. Come on, Ripley. Come on. It looked good from over here. Claire Fear, what's up? How's it going? Flashlight batteries. This thing's like my most used device. I think you want to be taking survivors off this ship. Pretty sure that's the last fucking thing you want to be taking off here. Not without some medical checks. Hop in the door.
New follow, Claire Fear. Thanks for the follow. Really do appreciate that. Uh, no, this is not my first time playing it. This is my second run through on hard. Uh, we do spooky game night every, uh, every night from 10 p.m. to, uh, whenever. Now I feel normal because I can hear you through the headset. Oh my goodness. I was really trying to avoid contact with these guys, but damn. Thank you for the follow, by the way. Sorry, I wasn't in the chat yet. Yeah, my wife and I usually do co-op. I'm the one that does the spooky games at night. Oh my god, I can't believe I just missed a shotgun. Or I can't believe that... Are you kidding me? Oh my goodness. It was probably worth it, considering that I... Oh yeah. I've died, I think that's like death 25 right there. Have you died other than that? Because nope. I've only... Okay. I just I wanted to make sure while. I haven't missed any. Nope, I haven't died for a little bit. Okay, I dropped the bonus in the chat. Okay. Come on, there we go. Okay. Notice there's not a lot of save points now. It's mainly just getting through it. Okay. Oh, come on, Ripley. She's not very good at loading this thing. Keep 
Shotgun, Shotgun up. up. We're gonna be needing it. So how far are you in the game now? Uh, decently far. Uh, everything's kind of going to shit. So we should uh, be done with this game within, what, the next two days? Should be. I'll check to see if Dire Wolf's there. Damn it, game. It says that he's here. Started. I was just seeing if he's making it, seeing if he was a troop tonight. <laughs> Because he was having problems hearing us earlier, so that's why I typed it in the chat. Uh. Wish there was an achievement for never using a flare, because I haven't used a, a damn one. Anything else in these bad um, boys? We like spooky games, yes. Um, we... Play the, like, I can drop our schedule in the chat. We we are a variety streamers. We're a husband and wife co-op. You okay? Listen, Marlowe's permissions are still locked at this terminal. If we had the coordinates for the torrent, we could align and transmit a dish's magnet, bypass Apollo completely. We do survival in the morning, yes. shooter, and then spoopy games late at night. Yes, we've already played Layers of Fear. We plan on revisiting it, though, because we want to get the um, the other alternate endings. Because we got... What was it? The universal end ending? We got the neutral ending. The neutral ending. We usually don't announce, um, yeah, there's three endings to it. Um, we usually don't announce what spooky game we're doing until we do it, because, um, it's a sub perk to know what we're playing before we play it. So the subs know what we're gonna play. So it's just kind of a surprise, unless we're in the middle of a game like this, where he's been playing this all week. So everybody knows, oh, Alien Isolation will be at this time. But other than that, we usually don't tell what games we're going to play next or anything like that. I take it you didn't try to go for the no killing the people? <laughs> no. no. That went out the window. Shit. That went out the window at the very first section when I ran into him because I... Bully ding that lady in the side of the head with that maintenance jack. How come? Like on purpose or an accident? Yeah, she was going to turn around. Oh. I was going to try to sneak by her to go to the door to go downstairs, but she started to turn, so I didn't want to have to repeat the scenario a hundred times, so I just hit her with it. Knocked her down. Is Mady asleep? Just about. <laughs> as soon as I said that, he lifted up his head. Yeah, he looks up like, oh no, I'm not asleep. I need Mady. You're insane? Okay. <laughs> Door locked. Ion torch. Go! You've actually done a lot better this time around. Yeah. On this game. 
Like, you died a lot the first time. Oh, yeah. I probably died 40 plus times just in the medical wing alone. That was painful. Tell me about it. I was the one doing it. <laughs> <laughs> I remember everybody in the chat yelling at you, trying to help you. Oh, it was painful. Come on, go up the ladder. Yeah. Darian, hand that to your mom. Sorry. Did anybody host the needed bonuses? Mm, no, I don't think so. Ripcord's the only one I know that hosted, but I thought he had already. I can check it right here. What? What? I'm glad I remember that puzzle because I can't even hardly see. And that's an awesome view. Oh, there we go. So I thought there was another one somewhere. Oh, the game is hard, but I think that is what makes it fun. Oh yeah. Thank God, Ricardo, I found them. It's a lot of trial and error, but uh, like any other game, if you do it enough, you'll eventually get through it. Yeah, because he's definitely played through this time with less deaths. A lot less. Like I said, just in the just in the medical area, when I first got in there, I probably died 40 plus times. I've died less than that all the way through the game thus far. I forgot to ask you, um, on Ark, whenever you transfer dinos from one map to... I forgot, Tyler wanted to know. When you transfer dinos from one map to another... Um, do you have to fight the Broodmother first before you're I, able to do that? No, I don't think so. I think you just load your dinos into the obelisk. Weird. Like, I don't even know how you do that. You just download them in there. I think you can download your character in there, too. We were having a hell of a time on the center. I see that. I wasn't afraid to die, I accepted the fact that I was gonna. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you gotta do. Space time. It's probably not static, it's probably the sound of the air conditioner back there. I 
Oh, I have no idea. Yep, just walking around out here. Bunch of particles and shit flying through the air. Pieces of rock and space dust and everything else. Get a damn hole ripped in my suit. Then I'm fucked. Careful. There's a bee's nest. She can't run out here, apparently. Look at that. Like, I would totally get lost just looking around outside. Like, you couldn't get me to do any work. I'd be like, babe, come over here with me. Let's look at these stars. <laughs> <laughs> Plenty of them. Okay, let's get up here. We're winding down to about... Mm, depending on how many times I die. Somewhere in the neighborhood about two hours left of gameplay. They're fading fast. And it's only 12.30. They must have played really hard outside today. Maybe he was outside all day today. It's ashes, ain't it? Space dust. Space dust. What'd you do the click for? <laughs> I felt like you were calling the cat. Where is she, by the way? Your guys' bedroom door ain't open, right? Oh yeah. Look at that big old bastard out there. Power clamp release. Nice. Everything into position. Resume, come on.
I wish you could run out here. I really wish you could run. This thing turns slow. Good thing we're not on a damn time schedule here. Beep, beep, beep on these unlabeled buttons. Find a way for the Torrens to dock. I could say the second journey through the game has been a lot better than the first. Although I see there are some achievements that I think would be awesome to get, but they would be incredibly hard. I think even on easy, I think even on easy the achievements would be really hard. There's one going through the entire game without dying. The entire game without dying, which is pretty ridiculous in some of the parts. Um, there's a lot of chapter sequence ones where it's like, don't get seen by the alien at all in this area, don't kill any humans. I think there's one for not even killing androids too, but... Alright, we made it back to dock. Oh, here it comes. Eagle Falcon, thank you for the host. Ricardo, do you copy? Ricardo, come in. 
Ricardo, come in. Rusa, thank you for the host. Eagle, thank Mr. you for Rusa. the host. I'll get you guys your points here. How you been, Rusa? We scheduled that stream. Yes, we did. I'll drop it in the chat in just a second. Let me get you guys your bonus points. 24 hour. Bob Ross stream. Those of you that don't know what that is, I'll be... What the fuck? Did you just die? I'm about ready to. He said he was sick today. Stomach flu. That sucks. Bonding had it too. Hope it stays away from me, cause I already feel like I have the flu every damn day. You fucking bastard. You're dead. God! You're dead! What the hell took the alien so long to fucking get over here? That dude fired like four shots at me. Before it ever came trudging over here. What the hell was it doing? Having a sandwich? A bitch. It's like you would think people would want to work together in this scenario so everyone can get off the fucking ship. Vermin cause diseases. Don't let them spread. Before they breed, track and exterminate. That's what they invented these trackers for, is to track down vermin. Hope you get better, Rusa. Yeah, I hope you get to feeling better, man. Emergency. Please attend your assigned evacuation. The alien is brutal. Shows no remorse. I'm gonna end up dying again here because. Fucking hell, man. Like, I'm gonna take. I'm, I'm gonna screw these motherfuckers over here. You better not be getting sick back there. I'll put you in quarantine. Put him outside one day and he gets... Comes back with a cough. I'll put his ass in quarantine. Emergency. I can't move right now. Now the door's unlocked. It doesn't know I'm in here yet. It's gonna Watch. know. Yeah, it's gonna know, cause I'm gonna fucking... <gasps> Fuck! Did you not see it in front of you? 
Damn it! Again, that's bullshit. I throw the noisemaker over there. You're supposed to go over there, not come fucking running to me. Did you not notice it though? No, I didn't know it dropped back down the vent. I can't hear it. Oh. It seems like the deaths I've had this round have just been nonsense. I've died more by synthetics than the alien itself. At least we get to see him murder this person again. Use him as bait! That's what I was trying to do, was use it as bait, but... They're like, nope. Sorry. See, look, it's gone. See, but it went through that door or the vent. It went through the vent right there. Guys, intruder! There, how do you like that? Hopefully the alien will go eat it. Go! Run! Ah! Oh, now the door closes fast. What a shit. <laughs> That's what that lady gets. Causing me all those fucking problems. Could have had a quick death by the alien. Instead, I had to set you on fire. To get the results that I needed. Sounds like it's trying to force its way through here. Like, how did you get had by that thing? Like, you should have locked yourself down in that room. Got a face hugger on him. Why does it stop coming after you? Because it's smart. It knows it's going to get burned. It learns. That's the thing. The harder the difficulty, the more it learns from what you do to it. Which is why in some instances it's almost like you can hold it off. But other times, like, that's why Nightmare Mode would be a pain in the ass, because, like, down in that hive area, you would basically have to go unseen the whole time, because that tackle maneuver gets replaced. Yeah. I knew that, because I read it. Oh, then I get gunned down from behind. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Yep, that's what you get. You get killed by the fucking alien. It's gonna start me all the way back there again. You son of a bitch. He totally ignored what you were saying. <laughs> You're muted, by the way. Oh, he's going over there now. Hey. Good, he's going to take that broad out. Babe, is my purse by you? 
Yes. Can you hand it to DJ? Look at this guy. You're gonna get seen, sucker. Oh, maybe not. Aiden. Cough drop. We got the intruder. Yep, go ahead and keep shooting at me. Oh, what the, oh, fuck? What the fuck? I get killed because that guy fired a weapon. What kind of bullshit is that? Good lord. Versus said to LOL. Like, what the fuck is that? I was like, okay, keep shooting. Because it's going to come after you. Oh, I forgot to drop that. Oh, did I drop it in there for Rusa? Oh, yeah, the stream information, I did drop it in there. Man, I'm losing my mind. Yeah. Sorry. <sighs> like, how does it even get in here? There's no fucking vent in here. Unless it broke that out of there, but I don't doubt that it. That looks like a vent right there. Where? Right there. That's an elevator shaft. Maybe that's where it came from. Or right. It sure is a right there. Nope, I turned around. It was behind me. It surely held him fit through that small gap right there, as big as it Maybe is. Maybe the other door to the left. Isn't there a door to? Oh, that's not a door. Nope. I have no idea. Fucking hell. There's another save up here, and I'm going to fucking use it. Hopefully without any hubbub from this alien. Come on, Ripley! Jeez. There's some animations that seem like they take a like forever to get through. Cough drop. Motherfucker. I know. Just heard it. Come on, game. Medic.
You're muted. Fucking hell. <laughs> Apparently him wearing fucking armor. A thousand ways to die in alien isolation. <laughs> oh, it's painful. Now I'm starting to rack up the deaths that I have avoided most of the game. How come when I'm on this Xbox? That was not good. Get out of here. Go the other way. I don't know. Oh, apparently throwing a noisemaker does nothing now. The fuck did I even make him for? You can do it. That's bullshit. There it is. There you go. Motherfucker! Oh, it's getting painful. Was that another death? Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Like I did not have this much trouble this on uh, this part last time through. It was the damn medical wing. Now that I'm on this part, it's like, oh, here, let us give you a, a good screw job. His trusted said yes, this mode is isn't so easy. No 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 it is not. First time you played it though, you played it on this mode too, didn't you? Yep. But you died a lot just because it was your first time ever playing it. Yeah. Like okay tracker, don't bother picking anything up. I hate that. That's like the most annoying fucking thing that it does. I'd rather it just fucking kill me.
<laughs> Distrusted said, I hate this creepy, stupid alien, lol. <laughs> oh, he's a pain in the ass. Like, like a big satisfying moment of the game is when you get to jettison the one out into space. And you get like that... That mild reprieve. Yes. Pull that panel, Ripley. What good this is gonna do me because it's probably gonna take me back the direction I ain't even supposed to be going. No, oh, I would play multiplayer. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh. Oh, the pain. The pain is real. I take it you're ready to be past that part. I'm ready to punch Ripley in the face. That alien is a pain in my ass. He dicks, you bastard. Okay. He said, haha, yep, it scared me all the time, a lot, and this time I needed a lot of new underpants, lol. <laughs> <laughs> Bruce has said that timing. Yeah, that timing's a bitch. I shouldn't have wasted time over there on that ion torch. So take it easy, man. Bob Ross is May 6th, man.
was trusted. It said, but one game is still better as Alien Outlast. And by the way, happy Easter to you both. Happy Easter, Distrusted. Oh, thank you. And yeah, he's played what the Outlast. Fuck, Amanda? Yes, I've played Outlast. Yeah, Amanda Ripley, that's who I'm playing as. She kept getting burned by the shit behind her. Driving me fucking nuts. Good God, get out of this area. Jesus. Yeah, she about got me screwed because I backed up into the fire and she's like, Ugh, and putting her hands up in front of her face. I don't know, that's just what came out. G. This game right now is only seven fifty. The first one. You can buy both of them for sixty, but it's the first one for seven fifty. Seven dollars and fifty cents. I was just telling you. I'm just looking at okay. the spring sale. I was just watching gameplay of that game. Thank God, another save point. Whoa, lag. Why am I getting lag on this game? I know why that game's so cheap because it was garbage what's that thief yeah someone there Okay, so we gotta figure out how to restore power here. Like a lot of the latter half of the game I don't remember. 
So that ain't really going to help me too much. Play what? Yeah, that's fine. I hate you, alien. I, I really do. I really hate your fucking guts. All right, guys. So, I think that's where we're going to call it for tonight. It's getting late. we got to get up and do a morning stream as well. So we'll pick up right here at 10 p.m. All right, correction, we will not be having a morning stream tomorrow, but uh, it is getting kind of late. We've been up since about 6 o'clock this morning, and it's Easter with our kids, so we'll probably be on sometime tomorrow. I don't know when. Follow us on Twitch, follow us on Twitter, and uh, look for those posts, and we'll be on, guys. Peace and love. At least I get to watch that fucker get murdered. Bastard. All right, guys, later.